11 years ago, Angelo Esposito was the darling of the Montreal sports world. He had a monster junior hockey career and was set to light it up in the NHL. But he ran into some bad luck. Injuries took a toll. He dealt with multiple concussions and several knee surgeries. He played several years in Europe, but was forced to hang up his skates a few years ago. I'm Dominic Fazioli. Well, Esposito is now thriving in his new career. Actually, he has two new careers, and he's pretty busy. The 29-year-old works as a real estate developer, and he teaches hockey skills to kids. He's a player development coach at a sports complex in West End, Montreal, and at a school in Westmount. He also runs the practices for a peewee team in Outremont. Esposito loves it. But I enjoy working with the kids and kind of seeing when I show them something and seeing them do it. And then, you know, the first few times it's, a, it's hard. And then after a while, they start picking it up. It's been two years now I've been doing this. I've been getting a lot more comfortable with the kids. I think I've been growing. And even as a teacher, I'm getting better. Not as a, like, not a skill coach, but just as a teacher and talking to the kids. It's been getting easier and easier as it's going. They're always like, coach, you got drafted first, uh, first, uh, first round, 20th overall at Pittsburgh. Uh, you play at the World Juniors, you scored the game-winning goal. I'm like, so did you go online and Google me? And they're like, yeah, yeah, we saw all your pictures and your goals. Tu prends ta shot, all right? Arrête devant le but. You know, yes, there is disappointment. I never got to play in the NHL, but it's part of life and everything happens for a reason. And, you know, I've, I've managed to create something good and I'm working to get even, you know, become even more successful. Esposito says he's in a good place right now, but he does admit that he sometimes misses being in the locker room with the boys. So we asked him, would he one day consider a coaching opportunity in the big leagues? If there's a door that opens later on, you know, I'm not going to say no to it. For more on this story, head on over to journalmetro.com. Thanks for watching.